Hey, it's Anfa. Today I'm doing a silly video, but there is a slight educational element to it, so I hope you'll forgive me for that. You see, sometimes I can't keep myself from using bad words, and this channel is dedicated to education and inspiration and music. And I know there's young people watching, so I know I should and I want to keep it family friendly. Or basically, I don't want to make your parents go, that foul mouthed Anfa guy is having a bad influence on our daughter. She ain't ever watching him videos again. But bleeping the curses with the fing one kilohertz sine wave ain't that fun anymore in this day and age. So I thought, let's reach out to the community and ask for some suggestions for family friendly, free and open source related curse words. So I can use them to replace the real curse words in my videos. Or yours. So I reached out on Mastodon and I received some pretty awesome contributions from you. I promised I'm gonna scream them out of the top of my lungs and record that and then provide free downloads for everyone under a permissive license. That's done. You can check that out in the video description or wait until the end of this video for some more details. But before I show you my performance, you know I'm a synth freak. And there's some pretty cool free and open source speech synthesizers out there. Prep my bin log, you piece of dumb. So let's give them a go first. I'm, I'm also including all the links in the video description so you can check them out, use them on your own, synthesize some lines for your music maybe, or just generate wave tables for your synthesizer. The possibilities are endless! First, I'm going to be using Espeak. E -speak. It's a free and open source, of course, speech synthesizer supporting many languages. E -speak movie, what to. It's not the most transparent sounding one. What did you just say about me? But I really like its weird robotic sound, and you probably recognize it from some videos on YouTube. Beep, boop, I'm a robot. I think it's pretty well known and used in a lot of Half-Life mods. Hold on a minute. I'm using the JetSpeaker program, which is a great user interface for Speak, which on its own is a common line application. So it's a little bit difficult to swap out voices, etc. You need to read the manual. Read the manual. So here's the performance by Speak. Welcome into the stage. Ha ha ha! Gimping heck! Well prep, my aunt. You silly pseudo. Holy shift key. Ima compress your tarballs until your head and tail switch. You said fat FSCK. Alright, so that was Aspeak. It's pronounced e speak. You silly pseudo. Next up is Embrola. Embrola is a FAT grub. Embrola is way better sounding. FSCKU. It reminds me of the early Ivana voices. Ivona is a proprietary hex dump batch. Shut the FSCK down, Speak. It also works with the JetSpeaker user interface, so that makes it easier to use. Let's give it a try. Kernel panic. GNU slash Linux. Well grab my hand. You silly pseudo. Holy shift key. Apt purge yourself. You unmet dependency. Corrupted tarballs. So that was Embrola. Now for something on the completely different side of the speech synthesis regarding the sound and technology, let's give a big round of applause for Sam! Software Automatic Mouth! I am Sam. Hello, Alpha. Sam, you're so old, you're predating GNU slash herd. You also said tarballs. Speak, get back to dev slash null, where you belong. See, make me mimic you broken MBR. I am Adam, and you know it. I am Sam, software automatic mouth. I am a speech synthesis program. I like sky over pancakes. It's pronounced key, you unitted. I think your computer did teach you manners, Speak. Ha, ha, you're a retarded update, Sam. You don't even know what C++ is. 
I can at least pronounce words correctly. Espeak, stop bragging and let the old man page talk. Orantha will never finish this video. You remember we've got some unfinished business outside. If you keep stalling the shell script, we'll never get to that function. Oh shift, you're true. Sam, flush your binaries. Hello, binaries. Your little baby will grip my own. You're a guitar ball. Sam, it was originally written for 8-bit computers, it ran on the original Commodore C64, and I had one of these, the computer, not the program, but my, my parents just trashed it somewhere in, in the early 2000s and I, I never noticed and I didn't have a chance to stop them. It would have been worth millions right now. Fine! Now, seriously, uh, someone has reverse-engineered the original program and created an open-source implementation. Now, you can use it on the website or install it. I, I believe it's installable from AUR, the Arch User Repository. I don't know if other distributions have packages for it. You can always compile it yourself. It's, it's a single C file, so it's really not that hard to do. There's one more speech synthesizer I would like to show you. It's called Mimic. I don't know much about it, but it sounds very different from the rest, and I really like it. And I really like it. So that was Mimic. There's many more. When you search for speech synthesizers in the Arch user repository, you can find a ton of stuff. Stuff. Not everything, I, not, I wasn't able to use everything, I wasn't able to understand how am I supposed to use all of them, but these are the most interesting ones I've found. All the links are in the video description, and now, for the stuff that the speech synthesizers can do as well. Rock and roll! Dev no! Backtrace! Kernel panic! GNU slash Linux! Gentoo! Segfault! Proprietary! Gimping hack! Well, grab my aunt! You silly pseudo! Holy shift key! Apt purge yourself! Yo, I'm mad dependency! FSCK! Grab my bin like you piece of core dump! I'ma compress your tarballs until your head and tail switch, you sad fat FSDK! Corrupted tarballs! Bit rot! Hard bleed! Spectra! You random encryption! RM dash forward slash! I think that's it. Quality content, 10 out of 10, IGN. About the downloads. There's that's there. You can download the audio. It's licensed under CC0. It's a completely free artistic license. You can no attribution is required. You can download it. You can use it for commercial work, whatever. You don't even have to credit me. But it would be nice if you did so. And if you linked my free sound profile or this YouTube channel. So I will be thankful for that. Um, more people will be able to find my stuff. Stuff. So I'm uploading this to freesound.org, which is a fantastic repository of Creative Commons licensed uh, sound effects and other sound resources. But there's a catch. I only upload the files in FLAC format. FLAC. Now you see I get a lot of FLAC for that. FLAC. By the way, is it recording? Yes, it's still recording. And it seems like 80% of the people are too lazy to do a search query. If you're that lazy... Will grip my own. I require minimum effort of learning what is flak. What is flak? Baby, convert me. I'm not uploading sounds in WAV or WAV because flak has the same quality. It's bit by bit the same PCM stream, but it takes 50% less space on the servers and it's gonna download faster. It's gonna clog up the internet less. It's better in every way. Except for audio editing. What is irreplaceable there? But it seems that many commercial proprietary software packages don't support FLAC. But there are programs like FlickFlack or Audacity, 
which you can just download and export it to Wave or MP3 or whatever. I'm not uploading Waves because they're big, and I'm not uploading MP3s because they suck. Even if the patent has expired and they are free to use now, use Ogvorbis. Ogvorbis. It's better in every way, except that it's not supported by some lame hardware. All right, it's all for today. I may or may not use these bleepers in the future videos. We'll see. Feel free to use them. Make music with them. Make Half-Life mods with them. Whatever. Enjoy it, man. Check out the software speech synthesizers. Check out the sounds recorded. Enjoy. Big thanks for... Big thanks to... You can't speak and far. Go home. All the people who supplied their suggestions, I really enjoyed them and they made this much more interesting. Also, huge thanks to all the people who support my work on Patreon and LiberaPay. You guys helped me take out time to do this stuff and I'm really thankful for that. So, if you want to join these people and fund me doing silly videos like this one, please go to patreon.com slash anfa or liberapay.com slash anfa and buy me a coffee or something. I don't know. Anyway, I'll see you in the next video. Now, go. And make some music. Speak, where the system D are you? I am waiting for you, you zombified process. And if you're that lazy, go suck my left nut!